So it, it was a challenge to come up with the, the right type of bourbon that doesn't smell like someone just walked out of a bar. So we look to be inspired by the spirit of bourbon, the beauty of the process, the beauty of the aging, the beauty of materials, the oak, the craftsmanship, and that's what we focused on. For example, Cremo, I remember for, the, for this project, they asked us to, to work some, around something uh, sensual and not really like, uh, it was, it used to be fresh, but for my part, with the bobo and oak, was more sensual, more woody, ambery, uh, uh, spicy. So I, I know that I don't have to go on the floral and the, and the oriental and the fruity part. The top note is, is really this beautiful distiller spices and it's cardamom and elemi and beautiful orange and mandarin and all these other lovely notes. And the heart of the fragrance is actually an accord. An accord, just like in music, is a combination of notes of fragrances that were put together to create an essence or a feeling of bourbon because there's really no bourbon material. And he used materials that give an effect of, of cognac or materials that, that are just rich and lovely and, and give you a feeling of bourbon without it being boozy. And I remember I visited a long time ago in France a cognac company and the smell, the people were really passionate in what they're doing, like me as a perfumer. And uh, it figured like that, you know, I say, okay, I'm gonna do this accord. Remember the, when I work in a in in cognac uh, uh, factory, the smell, some of them are smoky, the, some of them are, are really floral, some of them are really spicy. Fragrance is so personal, scent is so personal. Our fragrances can work for any kind of guy, depending on what you like. This scent is nuanced and layered, and I can really see it for a, a guy who appreciates a really well-crafted scent.